Doria Dao from FineTuners.ai. In the past two years, we've been working closely with some of the biggest mobile game companies in the world, helping them integrate AI into their art pipelines. Today, I'm going to show you eight extremely popular uses of Gen AI in gaming. Follow me. By far, the most common use in gaming is to color line arts with AI. You see, in traditional manners, the path from this to this, it can take a day or two. However, with AI, this happens almost instantly. On top of this, if you have a model that knows your game's style or characters, you can take a very rough sketch and turn it into a rendered image, controlling the colors as well, and this happens, again, very quickly. Which takes me to the next use. Modeling a character with AI can be a hell of a time saver. All you need is a few good images of your character and you can train your model. Need to dress it up as a librarian or as a ballerina or as a superhero? No problem. These images can be used for live ops, for social media feeds in the game, whatever you need. Dress up items. Everybody loves them. So expensive to make them. Now, if you follow topic one and two, you already know that you can have an AI model that takes care of that for you. And then dressing your character is as easy as one, two, three. There have been tremendous developments in this field recently. As of today, all you need is one 2D image and you can create a 3D model. In fact, you don't even have to have a 2D image. With services like Genie by Luma Labs, all you need is the width of your prompt and a 3D model is created. Automating tasks is one of the most cost-efficient things that we can do with AI today. Take this image for an example. An engagement post for social media. In traditional techniques, we would have created the background first, then choose our spot to hide, cut two more puzzle pieces for wrong answers and add the UI. With AI, we can chain these actions together into one flow that looks like this. We write a prompt and there we have it. Collection items. Every mobile game has it so players can collect. Again, with smart automation, we can take a very thin brief, pass it through an LLM to get good prompts, which go automatically into Stable Diffusion Comfy UI, and within minutes, the new collection is ready. This is a relatively complex thing to ask AI to do, but if we break it into several steps, we can definitely chain these steps together. Take a look at this Comfy UI flow. It starts by generating a very crude evolution image and then goes on to add details and style to each and every character in the chain. And you can see that they all look like the same character. So I hope you enjoyed this short video. If you did, please subscribe. And if you want me to elaborate on one of these processes, say so in the comments and I'll try to record a video. See you soon.